showbiz royalty siya na maituturing. Lumaki si Grace po sa piling ng mga magulang na minsan ang itinuring Harry at Reyna ng Philippine Cinema. At hindi man siya naging artista, ang pagiging MPRCB chairman niya ay tila patunay na kung ano daw ang puno ay siya rin ang bunga. Ngayong gabi, kamustahin po natin si Mary Grace Paul Yamansares dito sa Powerhouse. Kamusta po? Thank Hello, you so hi, much hi. For, for accepting our request. Thank you so yeah. much. Hey, look at you! Hello yeah. there! Yeah, that's my dog, Oshon. He's been with us for Oshon. a few bahay ni Grace ay may temang contemporary Philippine Colonia. Tatlong palapag ito na may lawak na 600 square meters. Ako ako, grade 1, nag-lessons ako. Tapos grade 2, bili lang ako ng dad ko ng piano. So ito, ito yun, yun, ito yun! Pero hindi, hindi lang, hindi lang yan yung maganda. Nung dineliver sa bahay, kasama si Hernani Cuenco. Oh my goodness! Because? Because he demonstrated for me and my mom. So he played, ganyan-ganyan. And then, uh, <laughs> so my dad said, Oh, you have to play as well as him someday. Wow. So, you know, that was such a tall order. Sino ang mas disiplinarian sa parents mo? The dad or the mom? Oh my God, hands down, my mom. <laughs> ah, Oo, oh, kasi my, my mom talaga hindi yan nagkukulang sa pangaral. Ah. My dad naman is very unconditional. Pero pagdating sa nung naging teenager na ako, mas kinatakutan ko na yung dad ko. Kasi siya yung, what time are you coming home? Are you wearing half slip? Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, he was uh, kind so, of conservative that way. Naku, di lalo na siguro nung may mga lumiligaw na. Okay lang. Um, especially my husband, parang he had to go to like some sort of initiation, like... Um, initiation? Alam mo naman yung drinking ng dad ko, parang oh, with friends. Wow. Oh. So he was there, siya yung audience, and ano. But, but uh, my dad's a good sport. Unang-una, hindi naman napapahiya yung dad ko eh. Parang he just wants to know your character. Mula sa arkitekto, contractor, at interior designer, lahat kaibigan ng kanyang pamilya. Kaya nga ang biruan nila, nakatipid daw sila dahil presyong kaibigan ang nakuha nila. Sa foyer, prominenting bubungad agad ang mga art pieces na gawa ng mga bigating Filipino artists. So, ibig mo sabihin, yung mga, mga art pieces mo dito, hindi lang talaga for the value and the aesthetic of, of it, no? but more may, may, may connection. Talaga no? meron. Meron, meron may connection po. sa inyo sa family ninyo. That is such a beautiful crucifix. Yes, that's uh, the Castrillo. What, what is the significance of that crucifix? Well, but then Castrillo kasi is a good friend of my dad. Sabi niya, kainuman daw niya yung dad ko sa Santa Ana, yung sa karerahan no? Oh, sa karerahan. So, in short, I started collecting his works kasi unang-una, halos binibigay na lang niya sa akin, no? Talagang discount. Oh, discount, discount. Oh, so super discount. No, no, just kidding. Alika, okay. <laughs> Sino mahilig sa inyo? It's actually my dad. No? He was actually the one who was into paintings. Oh. He had a, a good eye for it. I see something very oh. different. Oh yeah, this one is, is by... something different. This uh, painting is by Tom Dakiag. He actually paints naman a lot of uh, portraits of FPJ. So, nung nakita ko yan, parang sabi ko, okay to kasi at that time, di ba, rally kami ng rally. So, parang yan, no, yung social activism. Okay. Uh, basically, hindi ko makakalimutan yan kasi I was part of that. Broken sa gisag uh, ng, ano yun? Ng presidente? Ng presidente noon, nung panahon na yun, di ba? Oh, ano ba panahon yan? Panahon nung nakaraan na administrasyon. HR, of course. Well, ito naman, ang kwento ni HR, kasama yan ang mom ko nung siya'y uh, radio talent. Talaga? Oo. My mom nga was saying, naku, kung alam ko lang na magiging ganun siya kapopular. <laughs> Dapat lahat ng mga... Pinakyaw-pakyaw niya. Lahat ng sketches niya. Oh. Habang naghihintay daw uh -huh. ng segment nila, oh, oh. kinuha na niya. Oh. Pag 
salamat na making solong anak ni na FPJ at Susan si Grace. Hindi lingid sa marami na may talawa pang kilalang anak ang The King, sina Lobby at Ronya. When you were growing up, did you know that you already have half siblings? It's like this. Ronya and I, I knew about him a few years back. No, only. But, Actually, maybe I was in uh, high school when I found out. No? But Lovey, in all honesty, we didn't really know about her until my dad um, campaigned. Ah, talaga? Yeah. But so, did you get hurt nung nalaman mo that she existed? She was... Well, nothing had, personal to her. I mean, it's uh, just a normal the situation, reaction. The that, situation. The situation oh, and um, there, there are certain points in your life that you really have to just... Accept. Take it easy and accept yeah. it. Paano ka na-appease ng mother mo? I'm sure she also felt that you, you know, yeah. you felt bad about it na, na hindi ninyo alam. And she herself. Pa paano kayo nag, ano, nagbigaya ng consuelo or comfort to each other? My mind was more about how my mom would feel. Uh -oh. So, I was being very defensive also. Like, during the campaign, they'd interview me about it, and I'd always say, nire-respeto ko yung damdami ng aking ina, so I'd rather not go into details anymore. But it's there already, and um, we respect each other. Up to now, ganyan ang feelings ninyo? Okay naman. Pag nakita uh -huh. naman niya ako, eh, sasabihin ng tawag naman niya sa akin ate. Ah, uh, really? <laughs> the thing is, kasi I'm decades older than them. Mm -hmm. eh. So, the age gap is really, you know, mm -hmm. far from, mm -hmm. we're far from each other in terms of age. So, Iba naman yung interest nila. Um, I'm also quite proud of her achievements because mm -hmm. she's also had her awards. I mean, mm -hmm. um, she's making a name for herself. Mm -hmm. um, she has a totally different character, perhaps. At tulad ng foyer at living room, ang mga painting dito ay likha ng mga Filipino artist na may connection pa rin sa pamilya ni Grace. Sanso, yung dalawang yun, is it? Yes. Is it? It is. Kasi si Sanso naman, classmate ng lola ko. Oh, ayun na naman. May connect uh, na naman. May connection dahil nagpak may dedication. Yung isang painting na nakalagay, uh, For Your Mother Was My Classmate at the UP. Botong pa rin ko. Background designer nila si Botong. At saka layout, lay layout artist ng Royal Production, Fernando Poe Sr. ng mga memorabilia ng pamilya ni Grace. Dalawang dekada ng mag-asawa si na Mary Grace Po at Teodoro Misael Vera Llamansares. Nabiyayaan si na Grace at Neil ng tatlong anak. Now you have your own children. Ganun, ganun din ba kayong dalawang mag-asawa sa mga bata? It's a struggle every day. I think the hardest part of being a parent is um, uh, trusting your child uh, with the responsibilities that they should learn. But at the same time, still being involved in their life. Bukod sa mga memorabilia sa sariling pamilya, makikita din sa din ang ibang alaalang iniwan ni FPJ. Noong 2004 elections, tumakbo sa pagkapangulo si The King. Ang hindi ko pala po nagagang panan kayo sa presidente. Kaya kayo nang bahala. Ako yung umiyak na awa ako talaga sa kanya. Kasi parang... Imagine mo, pupunta ka sa isang lugar, sasabihin sa'yo, zero ang boto mo doon. Samantalang kinikwento nila, hindi makadaan ng motorcade. Oh Lahat pong ginagawa ng pangapi ay maaaring tisin, hindi pa namang punuan sa loob. Pero kapag kayo ang inapi, talagang mapupuno na ang sa loob. Yun yung palagi kong sinasabi, huwag naman nilang insultuhin yung intelligente ka ng tao. Mm -hmm. Pero bukod sa pagkatalo ni FPJ noong eleksyon, muling sinubok ng tadhana ang pamilya ni Grace. Nandatong ka ba when your, your dad uh, met the, his heart attack, was it? No, I was still in the States. In I fact, when I came States. here, pag land ng aeroplano ko, um, a few minutes later, my dad passed na eh. so, Hindi mo na naabutan? Hindi ko na naabutan. And my mom, consoling me, was saying, alam mo anak, he just really waited for your plane to land. You can just put it this way. Mm -hmm. Maybe he didn't want you to see all the oxygen, mm -hmm. tubes, and everything else. So I remember when I saw him, his body was still warm. His body was still warm, and he was wearing the you know hospital gown. Mm -hmm. But um, parang I thought my niece would give at that time. Eh? Mm -hmm. I was really you know shaking. But 
It, it was really a lonely, lonely time in our lives. That, um, but then it, it, it was made easier by the millions of people who sympathized with us. Ayon sa ilang taga-suporta ni Fernando Poe Jr., dinamdam umano ni The King ang nangyari noong eleksyon. Kaya siya nagkaroon ng aneurysm. Sa isyu naman ng dayaan sa halangan, nanindigan ang byuda ni FPJ. You have stolen the presidency! Not once, but twice! Nakayag na siya ng damdami niya. Parang feeling niya, tapos na siya doon eh. Um, hinihintay naman niya yung taong bayan na kung ano bang sa tingin nilang nararapat sa palagay namin, hindi lang naman kami ang dinaya, lahat naman tayo ay naisahan. So, hindi lang kami dapat ang humingi ng hustisya. Halos pitong taon na rin na mayapa si Fernando Poe Jr. Pumanaw man si FPJ. Nananatili pa rin ang determinasyon ng pamilya para makamit ang katotohanan at hustisya. Have you forgiven people who you think, you know, uh, were responsible for what happened? You know, I think it's wrong for me to be presumptuous and say I forgive them because actually sometimes uh, part of the healing process is the other party will ask for forgiveness Should, yeah. and there's an admission. Magpahiwati ka naman ng konting remorse, no? Eh, parang wala naman. Now, have we moved on? I think we've coped, but it is my advocacy that I think there should be some sort of a resolution because in the future, when we look back and these people aren't punished or they're not given whatever, I guess, reforms, no? if we don't adapt these reforms, it might A, happen again, or B, it might encourage people and say, eh, kung sila nga nakalusot, eh, pwede pa, di ba? Sunod naming pinasok ang kusina ng mga Limanzares. Do you like to cook? I do. I actually, ah, I can say confidently, I can cook. I can survive. Yeah, I have oh, to cook for, for my kids. That's right. uh, I'm not a gourmet cook. Okay. But uh, I can cook the basic sinigang really well. Ay, I mean, ay, well ay, ay, in ay, our ay, standards. Ah, ah, ah. Nilaga, oh, sinilaga, sinilaga, kare-kare. Kare-kare, yeah. Kare -kare. yeah. Ito naman schedule ng gamot ng aso ko. <laughs> Pet lover din pala si Grace tulad ko. Masaya namin napagkwentuhan ang aming mga alagang aso. They have one tablespoon of chicken a day, that's all. Just one tablespoon. Ang ganda din yan, ha? Yes. And all... Mga ino-overfeed niya yung aso. And all gulay. I'm not kidding you. What do you mean, like real gulay? Real gulay. They have kal kalabasa kung kalabasa, kamote kung kamote. Tapos nagtatanda rin ng, ka uh, ng kamote, kamote tops. Oh! Kaya pala haba ng buhay na oh, oh, kaso. Oh, oh, oh. Sa family room, madalas mag-relax at magkasama-sama ang pamilya ni Grace. Puno rin ito ng mga larawan ng bonding moments ng kanilang pamilya. Pero teka, kung panonood ng sine ang usapan, alam nyo ba na umekstra na rin pala siya sa pelikula noong bata pa lamang siya. Sa atik naman, matatagpuan ang kanilang mini-library. Si Grace mismo ang nag-ayos at nag-segregate nito ayon sa topic ng libro. Hello, Powerhouse. Welcome sa MTRCB office. Dito ako pumapasok araw-araw. Uh, Makita mo, pagpasok mo, may television agad. Yan ang nature ng trabaho natin, yan ang ginagawa natin. Station office, simple lang pero napakalinis. Ang pinaprocess natin dito sa registration, mga permits araw-araw, hindi kukulang sa isang daan. Ito po yung ating opisina. Moder modernity. Technology, uh, makita mo kasi nga parang gusto kong isang pa ang MTRCB sa future. Ito yung ating monitoring room, no? Para makita lahat ng mga pinapalabas na shows. Si Grace Paul Yamansares ang kasalukuyang namumuno bilang chairman ng Movie and Television Review and Classification Board o MTRCB. 
Kung kwalifikasyon sa edukasyon ang pag-uusapan, abay hindi pa uhuli itong asumptionistang si Grace. Nagtapos siya ng development studies sa University of the Philippines at kumuha pa ng kursong political science sa Boston College sa Estados Unidos. How do you compare yourself to the past leaders of the NTRC? Armida Sinulena. I wish I had her courage uh, all the time no? and her no-nonsense straight talk. Mm -hmm. But I, I tend to temper also what I, what I have to say because um, I also want to bring people together also. I mean, I know she did that, but I, I guess uh, my approach is a little different. Mm -hmm. And Manuelin Morato? Because I'm different. <laughs> You're different, okay. <laughs> and, but uh, you know, he's okay. I mean, he, he also, he had a big impact in the industry, but it's hard to pinpoint all the things and how different you are. But I, I just say that I respect them for the fact that they did their service and it's a lot of work. Uh -oh. um, it's also a lot of responsibility to the public. One wrong move, one wrong statement, mm -hmm. and then you're judged. Isa sa isinusulo ngayon ng MTRCB ay ang uniform classification sa mga TV shows. Kakaroon din tayo ng bagong klasifikasyon, ang SPG. Strong parental guidance, 9 p.m. until 5.30 a.m. ang airing nito. Para naman ang mga producers makagawa pa ng material na medyo mas mature. Pero kailangan responsable sila na ipapalabas lamang ito sa uh, panugit na 9, 9 p.m. hanggang 5.30 a.m. Kung wala naman sa kanyang tanggapan sa MTRCB, ang kanyang lanay sa bahay tila nagiging extension daw ng kanyang opisina. Dito raw kasi siya mas nakakapag-isip. Wow, it's a lanai out here. Yeah, it's a simple uh -huh. small lanai. Uh -huh. And you love to entertain here? Yeah, of course. Sa labas naman, matatagpuan ng pool at jacuzzi. There, and your mom calls it a? Bathtub. Bakit? <laughs> Hindi lang pala art collector itong si Grace. Isa rin siyang artist. Dahil ang isang ito, siya mismo ang nagdesenyo. Wow! So that's your art piece. That's my art, my recycle. <laughs> my recycle. Pool handle art. Look at piece. that. And ano ha? Eye yeah. catching siya dito ha in this yeah. area. Yeah. I imagine that. Oh. That used to be the handle to get in the pool. Ah, yeah. Okay, so I brought it to our welder oh, oh. and I said, can you make it round okay. so that it's like infinity? Daddy's girl, ika nga, si Grace. Pero sa kabila ng karangyaan at kasikatan ng kanyang mga magulang, nanatili siyang simple, mahiyain pa nga eh. What is, your, what is the mark that you want to make? Well, the mark that I definitely want to make is the awareness that the development of a child mm -hmm. is really a partnership between the parents, the school, and different government agencies. Mm -hmm. You cannot just rely on the MPRCP or any government agency or any network for that matter. Development begins at home. Grace, this is just such a lovely, lovely conversation with you. Think mo, di ko alam yan. Dami ko natutunan about you. Thank you so much. And of course, we wish you all the luck in all your advocacies and lahat yung mga gusto mo isulong para sa industriya ng show business. Karangalan ko po. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Paglilingkod sa bayan ang naisanang gawin ng yumaong ama. Ang siya namang ngayong ginagawa ni Grace Paul Liamansanes. Pero ano man ang maging pwesto niya sa gobyerno sa puso ng masang Pilipino, mananatili siyang prinsesa ni Dakin. Music